Yo, what's going on guys? It's your boy D-Hub here. And I'm bringing you guys another Black Ops 3 gameplay commentary here. Today we're going to be playing Team Deathmatch on the map Infection. As you guys can see, we are running the Scythe. Uh, I bought supply drops the other day. It wasn't much. It was only like $10 worth. And I opened, they had a deal this weekend. It was a thousand crypt or a thousand cod points for it was like uh, ten rare supply drops. So I did buy that and finally got the HG40. So we're gonna be using the HG40 here this gameplay with FMJ, four grip, and quick draw. I haven't really got all the attachments unlocked for it yet, but we do have. Uh, I'd say we have about half the attachments. Uh, first off, before we get started, I do want to apologize for not uploading yesterday. Um, I know I was gonna—I know I said that I was gonna upload every day, and I'm still gonna upload every day. Um, I got—I had some things going on yesterday, and I wasn't really home to upload, so I do apologize for that. So we're bringing you guys, like I said, this gameplay. This map is Infection. I'm sure most of you already know. But what I want to talk about today is possibly bringing you guys some Overwatch gameplay. I have uh, my buddy Brandon. He is gonna he's, he's he's gonna game share Overwatch with me or, or something like that, uh, and I'm gonna be able to play Overwatch. So what do you guys think about me bringing you guys some Overwatch gameplay? Um, I know like a lot of people, a lot of people when the game first come out, you know there was only like three or four maps and everything, and the game wasn't really that good, and nobody really liked watching it and anything, but. I want to know now that there's a lot more stuff out. What you guys would like? What you guys would you guys want to see? Overwatch gameplay. Drop a like on this video if you guys want to see Overwatch gameplay. Comment down below as well. But we're gonna talk a little bit about the gameplay here. This gameplay is a 30 and 10, I believe. I believe it's a 30, 30 kill, 10 death gameplay. HG40. I've I've wanted it ever since it came out. And my, for those of you who don't know, my supply drop look is god awful. The actually, <laughs> the supply drop that I opened that I got the HG40 out of, my sister opened. I didn't open it. So if that doesn't tell you anything, then I don't know what will. But my sister was the one that opened the supply drop that I got the HG40. Everything that I opened, I didn't get anything. <laughs> I didn't even get any epics when I opened them. I don't know. I think I got. I think I got like one or two. But. Yeah, my like my supply drop luck is terrible, and ever since this, ever since the HG40 came out, like I don't know how many updates ago, I've wanted it. Everybody, everybody I know has it, and I mean I finally have it. I feel like it's got, I feel like it got nerfed, or maybe maybe it just needs rapid fire. I heard the gun's pretty bad unless if you don't have rapid fire on it. So we're gonna unlock the rapid fire attachment and put it on. Um, but I mean overall, I mean the gun isn't terrible. I mean it's. It's a good gun, but I feel like it's been buffed because I, I remember using it before, and it was it was OP. I mean, it does it kills semi fast. I feel like it's been buffed or nerfed. I feel like before it was it did kill a lot faster than what it does now. But I mean, overall, it still is a really good weapon. But I think I'm gonna have my sister start opening my supply drops more because. I really want the peacekeeper too. I, I, I really want, or the eight seven or the seven eight the Ajax whatever the LMG. I'm not sure what it's called. It's like the a a seventy Ajax or something like that. I'd like that, and I'd like I'd like to get the peacekeeper because those those two weapons are just so OP. But yeah, we finally we finally did get it. So you probably I'm gonna grind to see if I can't get a nuclear with this thing. Uh, I actually haven't gotten a nuclear in Black Ops 2 yet. It's kind of depressing, but you know what? It is what it is. I am just ready for Infinite Warfare. I'm kind of—I don't want to say I'm done with this game because I'm obviously still gonna play it. But this game is getting kind of old. It's getting getting a little—it's—it's it's aging for me. And, you know, it's—I'm ready for the next Call of Duty. I'm ready for Infinite Warfare and COD 4. Now, I did mention in my last video that I didn't pre-order the game. So, the two weeks of... Excuse me. The two weeks that they are having the the beta. I, I believe it's a closed beta. Uh, that, that's what I've heard. 
If it is an open beta, please let me know in the comment section. But what I've heard that it is that it is a closed beta uh, for the game. So hopefully, if it is a closed, but hopefully it's not a closed beta. But if it is, hopefully they do like the weekends free or a weekend free, so I at least get to play it a little bit. But I'm really hyped for the game, and yeah, I'm I'm just really hyped for a new Call of Duty. Not gonna lie, I do kind of miss the old Call of Duties. I kind kind of miss MW3 and Black Ops 2. I wish I wouldn't have sold my PS3 because if I still have my PS3, I could bring you guys Black Ops 2 videos. But it is what it is. We have Black Ops 3. We're about to have Infinite Warfare. I'm I'm really excited for that. But ever ever the whole community is like hating on the game already, and it hasn't even come out. But I think the Infinite Warfare looks looks. I think it's gonna be a really good game. I think it's gonna be one of my personal favorites. But when the beta does launch, you guys will be seeing. If they do a free weekend, you guys will be seeing a lot of Infinite Warfare gameplay from me here on this channel. Uh, streams, gameplays, everything. You're gonna you're gonna see everything uh, Infinite Warfare related on my channel when the game does come out or when the beta comes out. But, nonetheless, this game is wrapping up with HG40. I don't know. I have I have my likes and I have my dislikes. But overall, I mean, it is a pretty good weapon. I mean, like, if it, it, it's good close up. But, long range. I mean, I guess, I guess, I mean, I guess it is a submachine gun. So, that kind of does fall into that category. But, nonetheless, this weapon is, it's a, it's a, it's a pretty average weapon. But let's go ahead and take a moment right here to witness this amazing kill cam right here. One shot. It's a pretty good kill cam. But anyways, if you guys did enjoy this video, please make sure to drop a like, comment, and subscribe on this video if you guys are new. And we're going to try something a little different here on this video today. We're going to go for a sub goal or a like goal. So if you guys did enjoy this video, let's try to hit that like button and get 15 likes on this video. 34 and 10. Like I said, drop a like, comment, and subscribe on this video if you guys are new, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace.